Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Shamaptin. Today I'm going to review Isn Tree Sleeping Mask Essence and their cream. And I have not so good experience with their products, but their ingredients list is very good. Their products are fragrance free, and overall I had really high hopes, but somewhat I'm kind of disappointed. I'm going to tell you why is that. So yeah, let's start with this review. So the first product that I have from Innistree is their Hyaluronic Acid Water Essence. And what is the special about this Hyaluronic Acid Essence? Because there are many Hyaluronic Acid uh, Serum Essence you can find. But uh, this is very expensive. Why to choose this? This essence actually has 8 kinds of Hyaluronic Acid. Yes, eventually there are different kinds of Hyaluronic Acid. There are high molecular hyaluronic acid which can stay on our skin surface because the molecule size is kind of big then there are low molecule hyaluronic acid which can penetrate deeper inside our skin and then there are medium molecule sized hyaluronic acid so they have used eight kinds of hyaluronic acid and they actually have used very good ingredients in this essence it contains glycerin then it has niacinamide b10 trehalose panthenol oat extract lecithin, beta-glucon, adenosine. This essence contains many glycols as well and one silicone as well. So it's not only going to provide the hydration, it's also going to lock the hydration. And the texture of this essence is very nice. It has very watery, non-sticky texture. It absorbs into the skin very well. About the results, honestly, I'm kind of disappointed. I don't know what's up with industry products. Their things they don't work on my skin as expected because I have tried their I think Nasnamad serum, then I have tried their face packs, then creams as well. The ingredients are really promising but these just don't work well on my skin. And even I spoke to my sister Ayushi, even she used industry products. Even she didn't see any significant result about moisturization and hydration. It was okay, just okay. Because the amount of price I'm paying for this essence, I expect it to be like more than average but this is not at least on my skin to be very honest i didn't see any significant amount of change when it comes to moisturization or hydration and yeah if you're willing to buy this product please use this on damp skin don't use this on dry skin i really don't know why they're calling this essence because this has this texture of a serum and they have promised that it's gonna be very good for dry skin I have kind of dry skin and I didn't find this that helpful to be very frank and it is gonna be good for skin barrier looking at the ingredients I can say okay the ingredients are really good for skin barrier and then they say that it's gonna provide hydration for our skin uh, where I saw very average result I rather use you know Cosmetic snail mucin because snail mucin essence that works better on my skin for hydration and like overall radiance the next product that i have from isn't tree is their water sleeping mask and <laughs> if you have watched my previous videos you will know that this product destroyed my skin i don't know why it happened because the ingredients are again very good it just didn't go well on my skin my skin was breaking out like anything it took me a while to recover and still my skin is not in a very good shape my skin's barrier has been sacrificed but to give an overall review this has very thick texture it's not like other gel products you know i have used other gel night sleeping mask they have this very watery thin texture and very easy to blend but this one has kind of thick texture very slimy um yellow kind of texture you know uh, this is very difficult when you are layering up with other products it is kind of difficult to work with and the ingredients are actually very good it has five different kinds of hyaluronic acid it has glycols glycerin beta glucon central acetic extract fig fruit extract lecithin it has panthenol it contains citric acid as well which comes in the middle section of the ingredients list then it has dimeticone allantoin sucrose ceramide and vitamin e so the ingredients are actually very good and i really wanted to love this product but my skin didn't love it at all it hated it <laughs> my skin reacted so badly and i still i still am recovering i look at the ingredients i don't see anything that can bother my skin might be the formulation i'm not sure it might work well for you but i had very bad experience from this product and uh i'm so disappointed so disappointed just my skin doesn't like their products except their other product that is 
their hyaluronic acid moist cream i love this cream i have been using this cream day and night it has good ingredients like glycerin shea butter betaine green tea leaf water and apricot oil oat extract ceramide peptides it works very well on my skin you can use this both day and night and doesn't feel greasy or sticky it has humectants it has oils emollients so it can provide the hydration and it can block the hydration as well so, and actually all the industry products are fragrance free so yes out of these three things i really love this one and if you can afford this if you think it can fit your budget then you can try this one even the other products i don't know how these are going to react on your skin because skincare is very subjective and the ingredients are good they are using good ingredients so there i can say okay you can try these things and for my skin with these two products that essence and a sleeping mask a sleeping mask destroyed my skin the essence was average and this cream is good so that's all for now i hope you found this to be helpful and thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe if you want to watch more videos like this and see you very soon bye bye